Good evening. On Santa's naughty or nice list, there's no doubt how a McCulley sixth grader will rate. The young boy fended off a suspected car thief and kidnapper with his bare hands, saving his younger sister. KITV4's Shane Enright has that story. Jay Yano didn't have the day off yesterday, so he planned to take his two young children to work with him. As his kids loaded into his truck, parked right outside their McCulley home, Yano left the vehicle running as he quickly walked to the rear of the truck. And that's when I noticed the guy walking from across the street coming over. Yano says within a split second, his truck began to pull forward with his nine-year-old daughter and 11-year-old son inside. He ran to the driver's side door. I opened the car door. I saw my son holding the guy down with his left hand. I just grabbed his shoulder and started punching his face, telling him to get out of the truck. Jonah Yano says he wasn't scared. His younger sister was in trouble and he needed to help her. Despite being much smaller than the 35 year old suspect, Jonah gave his father enough time to pull the suspect out of the truck. Yano says after ensuring the kids were safe with a neighbor, he ran after the suspect who had fled. He caught up with them here a couple blocks away and held him down until police arrived. If my son didn't jump in, he would have just taken off with her down the street. Brooklyn knows she'll always have a big brother looking out for her. Jonah jokes, little sis owes him. Eh, $500. I thanked him and I hugged him. His parents say their son's years of jiu-jitsu practice came in handy, but beyond that, it was a brotherly love which can't be taught. And we don't know how bad it could have been, but I'm proud of him. Shane Enright, KITV4 News.